Kanti Manzisk in Siberia, our final destination for the World Strongman Cup. And it's head to head between Ralph Baer and Ravis Vidzis as to who's going to win. So close on points. But you saw it. It's Jesse Morunde shouting at the camera. He's thrown into the equation one more time. Well, Morunde looked almost unstoppable in Yorkshire, but didn't get the victory there, and that hurt him. Simon Flint against Ralph Baer in the first event here, the tyre flip and carry. 380 kilos popped over like it's nothing by Ralph Baer. But someone can make it look even easier, and that's Ravis Vidzis. Which one of these two guys is going to win the final event in Siberia? And whoever does takes the title. Vidzis, World Cup of Strongman Champion, currently won that in 2004, and he won it comfortably as well. This is going to be a much closer finish. Second event was the maximum log lift. And the big Russian, the Russia number two athlete, managed to hold on to 175 kilos just as the referee blew the whistle in time. But by virtue of less lifts, even though it's the same weight, 175 kilos was a winning margin and a winning weight for Jesse Marunde, the American. Elbrus Nigmatulin, a Siberian local and former Russian arm wrestling champion, was the first to attack the Conan circle. Now this implement of torture, very simple, who can carry it the furthest? And at 1,100 plus degrees, he was looking virtually unbeatable. Except for this guy, his compatriot, Kononets. Well, he's never been on the international scene before. Well, I think we'll see him again. He managed just over 1,100 as well. But it was Nick Matulin who only needed a good finish in the power stairs. Here he is on the left, and he would take the bronze. Michael Staroff on the right just couldn't produce the goods on the day. He was to finish outside the medals. Nick Matulin driving home to a very appreciative home audience. But it was the battle of the big guns. Ravis Vidzis versus Jesse Marunde. Well, Vidzis pretty much knew he was going to win the overall World Cup of Strongman standings. Now, Ralph Baer was too far behind. But on the day, who would be the champion of the final Grand Prix? Marunde just had to hang on in the top four. And Vidzis had to finish first. Well, Marundi didn't do that. He was way outside the top four in the power stairs. And Vidzis won not only the last event, but the overall World Cup as well. What a finish for the Latvian. Well, that's it for the World Strongman Cup season 2005. We've had passion and we've had plenty of power. Until next year, that's it from me, Colin Bryce. Goodbye.